this message is for the givers. If you're not no giver, go ahead and back out. Because I found that when the message is not for that person and they hear the message, they get mad at the messenger. So, yeah, if you're not a giver, go ahead and back out because this message ain't for you. Right? So, this is for the givers, the people with the big heart, the people with um who who just help because they have to right a taker is going to continue to take they're never going to understand how much you've done for them because that's all you've done is give to them all the people that you know do unto others as you will wish them do unto you you know uh, all those people that, well, God said to, yeah, but guess what? You've been doing, right? You've been doing all of that giving and turning the other cheek and you've been doing all of that. And then when you look at it and you need some help, and sometimes it's not even monetarily because, you know, a lot of times you don't have to give the same way that you get you can, you can want someone to do something for you, go somewhere for you, help you with something. And out of all that you do, they're not going to do anything. They don't have a respect for you. So I say, I can't tell you what to do, okay? But a great barometer of how you should give or who you should give to is somebody that's going to give the, to you who has given to you or someone who has no problem with doing for you what you've done for them. All right. I'm going to go ahead and unpack this really quickly. We got the Knight of Cups. This is someone who is pretending to love you. This can be relationship, this can be family, this could be friends, this could be associates, this could be co-workers. Somebody is pretending to love you, right? You know it, but you act like you don't see it. You know that with the high priestess here in the reverse, you know it, right? Because you, even though this card is reversed, you exude uh, um, or represent a, a presence of knowing, right? Like, you know, but you refuse to see. You absolutely refuse to see that this person is playing in your face, pretending to love you. Yeah, that's the tower card. Anytime you get too attached to a person, place, or thing, there has to be upheaval. So, whoever this person is that is using you for your love, no, and you know it, this will be their downfall. A lot of times we think that it's something that we can do when in reality... I believe, this is my belief. I'm not putting this on you. I believe it pisses God off when we as human think that we can help when God himself has set into motion the things to happen to that person. And then we step in thinking that we're helping. And God be like, I did that. <laughs> I caused that. And here you come. Trying to save the motherfucking day. Okay. So the next time. This person. Comes to you with this fake love. And you know it. But you ain't. You know. You're not standing up for self. You know it. But you're just hoping that this is real. Back up. But God, spirit, source, divine. Start cutting holes in your pocket. Stop taking away resources from you. I'll be back.